Hi guys, so this is a story time with me. I'm going to tell you one of the hardest days of school at recess of one of my whole life, basically. So this story starts like first grade, yeah, first grade. And so we're at recess, normal. Me and my friends were just like talking, figure out what, figuring out what to play. We picked Marco Polo, but the thing was, we were playing right next to like all the girls in our class because they all played the get together. I don't know why, but my eye itches. But one of them, named Rosalie, just ran up to me and said, hey, you want to come join our band? And I'm like, no, no, I really don't want to. And she's like, and she is actually the shortest girl, girl at first grade at the time. She was literally like here to me. Like I was literally a whole head taller than her. But she just ran up to me and said, do you want to join our band called the Gumdrop Band? But all my other friends said yes. Why? Because they thought they it would be fun. So we went over to them. We, we thought we were gonna be playing like music, like making music, like beatboxing. Like, I'm sorry, I my my beatboxing skills suck, but it's not the point. They tricked us. And yes, we actually got tricked by girls. They just started chasing us. I mean, like, it wasn't really bad because they weren't actually fast, but... Like, the thing was, we got tricked. So, we had to get payback. So, what did we do? Absolutely break their ankle. Like, we demolished them. Like, we just took their ankles and basically just cracked them full. And we were actually very, and I was actually very cold-hearted in first grade. Like, all my friends were, except to us, ourselves. Except, like, our whole group was nice to each other, except to girls. But, they had us, like, we, like, we had to juke them, like, go this way, go that way, go this way, go that way, go this way, go that way. Like, we just had to lead them, basically. So, it, because it came from them chasing us, to us, showing them how to run in zigzag lines. Why? I have absolutely no idea why. But hey, it's history. Recess ends, we go inside. Uh, so there's like water fountains. There's four water fountains right when you come in. Like me and my boys, we drink from the water fountains. Then there's literally a water fountain taller than Rosalie. I get to literally like right here, like to me and my friends. It's like here to Rosalie. Like it's actually, well, I don't really know, but the tr what I'm trying to say is that like water fountain is actually really tall. Okay, but, anyways, so, um, but, the bad thing was, I was sitting next to the whole group of girls. So, it was me, four, and four other people. It was, I'm just gonna name the girls, it was Rosalie right here, right next to me, Victoria, another girl. Presley, um, Mustafa, 
and then Peyton. Um, this was a really bad day for me. Really bad day for me. But, my day was saved. When I went home, I told no one about what happened. Because it was just such a subtle thing to happen. So I didn't tell anyone. And that's how the story ended. So yeah, like, subscribe, goodbye.